1967, Gerald Feinberg coined the term tachyon, a hypothetical particle which travels faster than light and could potentially allow us to travel into the past. The theory of special relativity states that the faster you move through space, the slower you move through time. Light travels so fast that it dilates time to the point of stopping. So what would happen if something traveled faster than the speed of light? That's right, it would reverse time. And this is where the debate begins. Most physicists today do not consider the tachyon to be a real particle because it violates causality and various laws of physics. However, in 2012, physicists observed and tested neutrinos. When measuring the speed of the neutrino, all measurements yielded average speeds slightly above the speed of light. What's more is that the neutrino's rest mass squared was measured through oscillations. It turned out to be negative, proving that its rest mass is imaginary. Special relativity states that positive masses must always travel slower than the speed of light. Therefore, it is logical that the converse would be true, which is that negative masses must always travel faster than the speed of light. This checks out with the neutrino observations that the physicists made, thus proving that the observed neutrinos were indeed tachyons, and tachyons actually do exist. So, what does this mean? Is time travel into the past actually possible? Well, not exactly. Although we would measure a neutrino's time as going slightly into the past, they do not actually go there. In other words, our measurement systems are not capable of measuring such speeds because they can't detect the particle if light itself can't catch up to it.